सो हेलो एवरी वन वन सेकेंड वेलकम टू अनदर वीडियो सो एज यू कैन सी ऑन द बैक साइड दैट इज द फॉरेस्ट या सस्पेंस आ सो रियली इट्स लुकिंग वेरी ब्यूटिफुल सो टूडे इन दिस वीडियो आई विल एक्सप्लेन एवरी थिंग रिगार्डिंग द फॉरेस्ट या सस्पेंस आ लाइक हाउ टू कल्टिवेट इट हाउ टू ग्रो इट वेन टू प्लांट इट वेन टू प्रून इट एवरी थिंग वेन यूट फ्लावर सो एवरी थिंग इज गोइंग टू बी इंक्लूडेड इन दिस वीडियो सो फ्रेंड्स विदाउट एनी डेट लेट्स स्टार्ट द वीडियो सो दिस इज द मोस्ट कॉमनली यूज स्पीशीज ऑफ फॉरेस्ट या इन द गार्डन there are many species in forestia like there are some drooping character of forestia and there are other varieties which have like single one or two petals of flowering so but this is the multi petals one and it is the most commonly used one and now let's talk about where you can grow this plant so you can grow this plant wherever the climatic condition is like subtropical climatic condition temperate and uh, some tropical conditions are it is a deciduous shrub deciduous means the plants which shed their leaves in the autumn and winter season and in the spring it gain its flower and leaves and all so this is the common character of deciduous shrub and friends when it flowers this is the main important so it immediately flowers in the beginning of the spring so it is also known as signaling for the spring so whenever this flower blooms it is clearly indicated that the spring is coming so it is one of the beautiful plant because at the time as you can see the back side no leaves no flower at any plant but this flower blooms earlier than every plant so it is very beautiful plant it is signal it's a connection between spring and uh, winter and friends when it flowers all the stem all the stems will be covered with the flowers there will be no leaves so the flowers will remain on the plant till 2 uh, weeks after that the leaves will come and it will dominate and friends the important thing is that regarding the pruning because the pruning and flowering are connected to each other and this flower this flowers will come to the oldest branch not to the new branch so whenever you are going for pruning so do not prune all your branches in the winter season or at the end of winter season as we do for most of the plants so please do remember this so if you remove all your branches at the end of winter you will not get the flowers and you can plant it anywhere in the garden as you can see and it is a zero maintenance plant broad trolling plant you can plant it anywhere in the garden in the beginning you have to take care but after that no need to take care and friends and this flower doesn't have any fragments and you can grow this plant near the water source or near the salty area also and when coming to the sunlight please plant it in full sunlight area then only you will get this bushy flowering otherwise if you plant in semi shade it will grow but the flower will not come at this level 